Welcome Soul Family. Today we are doing the reading for Kim Terry and Song Joong Ki. Let's look at the relationship between them and let's see what's going to come out. Okay, so here we have the judgment. We have the Nine of Pentacles, we have the Ace of Wands, the Hierophant, and the Nine of Cups. Okay. Um, he most probably represents this card where I feel he is going through a cycle of transformation where a lot in him is changing. He is literally, uh, you know, being reborn, being... Uh, lifting himself up from where he went and you know coming to a complete different person so that is why i feel judgment you know shows him while she is full of energy she is somebody you know feisty you know bold full of fiery energy full of youth and ready to try new things she has that kind of energy and she's somebody who's so positive so when you meet her, you kind of absorb that positivity. And between both of them, what I find we have is the Nine of Pentacles, which is a nice, good friendship. I mean, you know, there is no, it's very grounded. It's very fulfilling to both of them. And uh, it is very soft. So I feel there is a lot of deep care and affection between both of them. They look out for each other. And I feel it's beneficial to both of them. This is a friendship which is going to benefit both of them. And, uh, yeah, overall something really nice. Okay, from this point, I had actually recorded the whole video, but it didn't come out well. The camera stopped recording in between, so this is the part which I had to re-record. So we'll start over here with their challenge. The Hierophant talks about con conventionality and tradition. And when I look at it as a challenge between f them, I would think what they think is traditional or what should be done or what is the right way to move ahead in, th in life might be different. So he might be a little bit more conventional than her. She might be someone who is much more risk taking than he is. Or uh, she might try to, you know, uh, try out different paths, which he wouldn't. But it's something like he watches over her in a, I think, in a protective way. And, um, that is what the challenge is. The outcome is a very emotionally fulfilling relationship. And it's mutually fulfilling. But if you see the person is alone. So it's not that they're together and they're having a good time. They help each other out emotionally. It is just emotional support between both of them. They're just good friends. At least this is how I read it right now. When I asked for his feelings towards her, I got these cards. Which is the Four of Wands, the Hanged Man and the Six of Pentacles. This basically tells me that he is very generous to her. He has this feeling of being generous because I think the emotional support she gives him, he returns it back. And she also makes him look at life in a different way. She has a different way of looking at life, which is very different from his conventional way. And so she gives him insight, which he mulls over. And then we have the Four of Wands. Even though this, like some people would say this is the marriage card, I don't think in between them that this is what it means. This basically, for me, denotes very good friendship. Because I don't see any other card which is showing romance. So I think it's a very stable friendship and they're going to be friends for a very long time. For her feelings, these are the cards which I got. I got the High Priestess, the Page of Wands, and I got the Ten of Swords. Now with the Ten of Swords, I feel she sees the hurt in him. Okay, and what she, the emotional support she wants to provide is to soothe that. And she does it by bringing her passion, her love of life, you know, uh, into the whole mix. So that, you know, he's re-energized, he feels better about life. And he looks, looks at life in a different way. And when I see as a high priestess also as her feelings, I feel... Um, she has that ability to, you know, um, mysteriously understand what is needed to be said. 
to make him feel better and she does that naturally that is what I feel she might also uh, she might also find him very mysterious he might not be the kind you know or originally he might not be the kind who really opens up very fast so she finds him a little bit mysterious and uh, yeah these are the two cards she finds him you know mysterious and hot and she's trying to help him out by infusing her energy into him that is what she's doing so overall i think this is a very good friendship it's going to last a long time and i wish the best for both of them and if you all enjoyed this reading please give this a thumbs up share comment and i would love to hear from you all thank you so much bye bye